Hello once again Monster Hobbies Model Car Mechanics. Well yesterday it was my birthday and uh, my family gave me some really cool things. So first off, I thought I'd just share them. Check this out. This is a Bat Manga. It was actually made in the 60s and uh, there it all is. I didn't know that um, in Japan they actually made a Batman series. It says in 1966 writer and illustrator Jiro Kuwata famously introduced the Dark Knight to a brand new audience in Japan. Almost 50 years later, Kuwata's classic tales remain the quintessential bat manga. In this new translated collection, English-speaking audiences will be able to explore these legendary stories for the first time, complete and unabridged. So, I was looking at this, and I thought it would be kind of neat to uh, build a diorama with Batman with but with the Japanese buildings in 132nd scale because <laughs> there's a lot of uh, Japanese model cars in 32 scale well as well as 24th so either way so next up I got a bunch of Hot Wheel cars this one's neat this is Mickey Mouse's Steamboat Willie from the original black and white cartoon that's an interesting one and then a 57 Chevy and then I ended up with this, which is uh, one of those Hot Wheel Lego type cars, which is interesting. So that was pretty cool. And then my youngest daughter drew and painted this. Isn't that neat? Yeah, she's 12. So there you go. That was a pretty cool one. And then finally, they got me this. So I'm going to be making a video coming up soon where I'm going to unbox this. And I have the earlier one from AMT. Um, and uh, you've seen that before. It's actually up here, the unboxing for that. So what I'm going to do is unbox this one and possibly compare the two. But I'm thinking of doing a build because back in the day, before YouTube and internet and all the rest, I used to be able to build a model in a month. <laughs> and I haven't really done that because, again, I'm trying to build monster hobbies up and I'm trying to... You know, well, you wake up in the morning, you check your email, and all of a sudden it's like 4 o'clock at night, or in the afternoon. You know, like this kind of nonsense. So I want to get back and actually build stuff. And I'm thinking, I've been looking at uh, some of these videos out there from some of the other model car builders and whatnot, where, uh, you know, I, I, I like to show people like how to Put this together and all that so i'm making all these instructional build videos maybe i shouldn't do that i should do them sort of like hpi guy does where he's just like okay and i got this now i already did the sub assemblies here and then you know move it on that way maybe it'll go faster because then i can spend more time at the bench actually putting it together instead of trying to show step by step and then my videos linger on forever never getting done because you know it's it's tough to do them that way i still need a good way to actually film these things I think you guys can assume that I know how to glue stuff together and scrape down seam lines. And I've made a bunch of videos where I've done my tips and techs so I can easily just go, here's the tire technique, there, okay, now as you can see it's done, you know, and, and move myself ahead a bit. So I'm going to try to do that with this wonderful 63 Impala. The other thing I noticed is I've only seen one photo of this on the internet where anybody's used those front ends. Sorry for the reflection, I haven't taken the shrink wrap off. But yeah, I haven't seen anywhere anyone built this custom. So I'm gonna try to build that custom out of this one and uh, be the first person on there with that custom. So anyway, until next time everyone, <laughs> happy model building. Thanks for all the birthday wishes off on Facebook and YouTube and everywhere else. And uh, we look forward to seeing you in the next videos.